welcome to Bucky Classic Movies. This week we will be exploring the greatest cinematic classics of all time. I'm your host, McCormick Birkenstock. We start this week with Ferris Bueller's Day Off, a movie in which a much despised principal gets in the way of his students just trying to have fun. Ballard? 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 Oh, hello again, and welcome back to Bucky Classic Movies. I'm your host, Donovan Butterwinkle. For Tuesday, we have a movie that's not really a classic, and you probably haven't seen it. But it has Seattle in the title, so that's a thing. It's Sleepless in Seattle, and let's take a look at Tuesday's movie. Hello. Hi. Oh. Hello. Welcome once again to Bucky Classic Movies. Our next film is a masterpiece following a female agent as she's inserted into an evil organization amidst impending doom. On Wednesday, no other film than Mean Girls. Wait, Mean Girls? Yeah, Mean Girls. Is that like really like a classic film? Yeah, it's a modern classic. Why don't I know you? Oh, I'm new. I just transferred from Bishop Blanchett. What, so you've never been to a real school before? But you're like really smart. Thank you. Oh my gosh, I love your scarf. Thanks, my mom made it for me. It's so vintage. So retro. What's retro? It's like slang from Portland. Can you give us some privacy for like one second? You should know that we don't do this very often, so it's kind of a big deal. We want you to have lunch with us every day for the rest of the week. Oh, it, it's okay. Coolness. So we'll see you tomorrow? On Wednesdays, we wear pink. Oh, why, hello. I didn't see you there. I'm Galileo Pushberry, and for Thursday's presentation, we'll be showing you an actual classic, The Good, the Bad, and the Ugly. A fun fact about the film is that it was actually named for the filmmaker's three children. Now let's go to a clip from Thursday's presentation. Oh, you guys are not going to like this. I think I forgot something at home. Really, Vinny? You forgot your gun again? Hello, I'm Gordon, here for Bucky Classic Movies. For our Friday presentation, we have a true cinematic masterpiece 
Goodwill Hunting, a film full of heart, genius, and most importantly, way overdone Boston accents. Let's take a look. Yeah, I mean, I know some friends that have small dogs and they're just yappy and they're annoying, but you know, I don't yeah, really know what to do about it. My dog's not really a yipper, you know, he's just perfect. I swallowed a bug. I've been sitting over there for 45 minutes waiting for you to come talk to me, but I'm tired now and I have to go home. And I couldn't wait any longer. Well, uh, I'm Will. Skylar. Well, I gotta go. Oh, and by the way, here's my number. And maybe we got to get coffee sometime. Maybe we can go to a thrift shop. If you think about it, it's more productive than getting coffee. Um, okay, sure. See you then. Hey, Bachi. How you like them apples? Are you even from Boston? Is that even a real accent? From everyone here at Bucky Classic Movies, I'm Flanagan McIntosh, saying good night and have a great spirit week.